Hey, how's it going? So, a friend of mine and myself, we both bought a game called Flowscape, in which it's a game where pretty much you just create anything. You create a scene within a 3D environment and usually does a nice little scenery, foresty, or even cultural kind of setting that you can make. And so what we started doing was we did creative competitions where we set a theme and we both make our creations and then we'll show it off to each other and see who kind of had the better creations. So these are just videos where you just get to see our creations and let us know which one you think won. Enjoy. Okay. So what is the next theme? Let's put this one. Uh, untouched by man. Isn't that like every nature one we've done? Fine. <laughs> I don't know then. Hmm? I don't know then. How about spring day? Spring day. Okay. A nice spring day. What is happening? Oh, what? Okay, now it's working, I guess. That was really, really weird. Spring day. <sighs> like those trees. I like those trees. That's too big for those trees, but I like those trees, so I'll keep those trees. Well done, Tiny. Good job. Go ahead and watch your show now if you'd like. Or increase the normal size. Toof. Put your toof. I think that's a pretty shot. Let's see, spring day. God, I wish I knew plants more. <laughs> Like, what kind of plants flourish it during the springtime? Hmm. 
Your lack of plant knowledge will be your downfall. Ah, my one weakness. Down. Little lies. I apologize for the barking in the background. It's barking so hard. I have no idea. Neighbor's dog. I'm going to close my window. Probably a good idea. Oh. <laughs> I guess I'll just die of heat in here. Well, I mean, does that mean I win? <laughs> Maybe. Okay, then. We're still good. Once these, uh, my ice water runs out, then I probably will. Probably die? Yeah. I can't go, like, two minutes without ice water, obviously. That's how the human body works. Of course. I really like this lavender that they use. Yeah, it adds a, like a nice thickening, like um, color. color. Yeah, it thickens the ground wall, making bring in some color into it. Mm -hmm. Ah, camera, please work with me. I don't know if cattails grow around springtime. Cattails are year round. Are they? Okay. Because I think they look nice. Tails are always nice. It's a nice touch. What's wrong with cattails? Well, if you cover an entire lake with them, then that might be an issue. It'd still be realistic. True. Because those things grow everywhere. The water on the land. Oh, you know what would be a great ammo for them to add to this game? Mm -hmm. Like a great herring. Those things are awesome. I think they're beautiful. Bring your herring. Do you know what they look like? Is it the one with the super long beak? Yeah, it kind of looks like Almost a stork, but not really. That's a heron. I could be wrong. Wait, did you think I said herring as in the fish? Yeah, that's what it sounded like you said. Well, I meant heron if I did improperly say it. Oh, okay. Correct you then.
Mm -hmm. Oh, those are really small. Okay, a little bigger. I want this tree to be a part of the shot, but there's no good angle of it. How's it going on your side? Mm -hmm. How's it going on your side? Going quite well. I like this vibe that I've got going on here. Inspired. Hmm. I'm like having moments where it's like, ah oh, man, I don't get enough view of this, so now I'm got like I'm doing mid like pretty much sculpting of the land a little late. Oh yeah. Yeah, and which resets a lot of my well, basically now a bunch of my plants are hovering. Oh, yeah. That part's never fun. <laughs> Not my favorite. Raining down some rocks. <laughs> Hang a little rock touches.
I think this is looking pretty good. Yeah. Oh, that's way too big. I hate that. Like, uh, one scaling for one thing is way too big for another one. You put in, like, a, a rock, and then you're like, oh, yeah, this giant boulder is great. And then you, you're like, oh, my God, it's the size of my map. <laughs> I think I'm oh, pretty much done. I heard you. I heard your thing. My chair. <laughs> mm -hmm. I think I'm pretty much done. So? Uh, I'm kind of just uh, like on the fence about something. Whether or not... Uh, like whether or not to have like the uh, the like time of day. You mean whether or not to have time of day? It's kind of a what? Constantly have the time of day. <laughs> what time of day do I want the setting to be? Because when you talk about like you know sp spring, you're like kind of seeing you're thinking about as more sunny and all that stuff, you know, where actually yeah, nature's blooming and all that stuff. But I think like to, uh, like spring also has like when there's a lot of fireflies. Yeah, at night. Yeah, but then it's like I want it to be closer to nighttime so that you can really see the fireflies. But then it's like it's not the vibrancy of spring that you naturally think of. Right. A little dilemma it's like it's like two paths you could easily take for this mm -hmm. and it's like i'm trying to get both oh, dear jesus <laughs> painting i'll understand let me see Mm 
Yeah, that's it. I could add more on the right there. Is am I popular? Can't select this grass for some reason. You know when you have to manipulate two axes to move something? Yeah, because it just it's not in the direction you want it to be. Yeah, uh, its angle is just that that it you want to move it forty five degrees one direction, so you have to move it south and then east. Yeah, and then you gotta pray to God that you actually moved it like proportional directions. Mm hmm. Oh, the struggle is real. fine. You say. You say. You're welcome. Okay. I should be right. Two, three, four, five, six. Mm. 
Yeah, I'm happy with this. Are you sure? Yeah. Just adding in my finishing stick touches. Don't you love doing that where you just sprinkle the branches or the twigs or the rocks? It's so satisfying. I showed this to Spencer and he said that it was one of his favorite things too. The sprinkle rocks and stuff. Oh man. Is that a good all man or a bad all man? Oh, it's a good all man. I am. I like this one. <laughs> okay. Ready? It was much. There we go. Okay. I think I want... What do you want? I'm going to try this real quick. Oh, that was awesome. A butterfly just flew right from my screen. Or right around oh, yeah. the camera.
just tweaking like one. I'm tweaking the, the picture. It's gonna not I'm like it's very good. The the aperture and stuff is a little wonky to play with. So I never do the whole focus thing like you do. Mm. Okay. Okay. You, you want to see mine first? And live. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> it's rain. Uh, spring showers. Mhm. Mm you gotta have rain. Of course. A nice warm rain. Uh, of course, it's like springtime. It, that I love the springtime because of the warm rains it has. Like you yeah. could just go out and in either a light sweatshirt or even just like t-shirt, and it'll be raining on you, but you won't feel cold at all. I love that. Mhm. Mm the nice warm rain. Yeah. So I was going with that with this okay. and all the flourishing uh, plants and all that stuff. I didn't put much focus on animals as I did with like the weather or the the small plant life. I gotta say, you know, you uh, you've gotten a lot better with putting in plant life. Yeah, it looks believable. Thank you. Hmm. You have to have like a good filling ground for like uh, just overgrown like small plants. That's what I think. Mm -hmm. Any critiques? I like it a lot. You're still tweaking stuff, or no? Any critiques? Oh, um, let's see. Well, I think that the the light should have been changed a little bit. It's a, it's raining, but the light that's coming down on the trees looks very focused. Oh, that rain sound, though, it sounds so good. The ambiance. Well, I was kind of go for like a more of a sunny rain. Yeah, like I uh, all I would do is turn the intent. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, so I'd I'd probably have it about. But now. <laughs> um, oh, side note. You're never going to see this from this angle. But just for my own knowledge, I knew this was there. And I know you I'm have to put the in. bad that I was thinking about putting in a gator too. I put him in a spot where it's like, oh, it fits because it's water there, but it's like, you're never going to see it on camera. Or in my camera spot that I've determined. Right. Okay. Let's see yours. Second. Okay, come on. Go live. Oh, you are going to pay. Where are you putting a dragon in? Well, you know, if you had listened when I said one second, it would have been better. The whole, oh yeah, well, no. Well, technically I this is a... Uh... it from this angle, but... Oh, were you going to put it behind the camera? Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. Oh, I like the rabbit silhouettes. Mm-hmm. That, that... I'm being mesmerized by the toad. 
Just staring <laughs> into my soul. You no dude. I thought this one turned out really nice. What do you think? Oh, okay, so the darkening of the area to the left of that toad. Mm -hmm. Like, because it was dark and all that, I'm like, that's some weird, uh, like, messed up landscape on the left there. And then I realized that's water. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Yeah, this is nice. It's not raining, but you know. Hey man, not ev not everywhere it's rained in spring. <laughs> I just took what I like from spring and I made sure it rained. There we go. Oh, we're on an even playing field. You want to make this better? In I was gonna say a dragon, but okay. Oh, now <laughs> light and thunderstorm? Hey, now you're going too far, man. You gotta save the thunderstorms for I'm summer down. for the wildfires. Hmm. That's true. <laughs> it's not hot enough for like for thunderstorms to happen yet. It's spring. No. Plus you're in like Utah or Montana. Yeah. Oh. What oh. do you think? Uh pros, cons, the... critiques? Um it's going it's showing the, the loading thing. That like outline the steam loading thing. Oh. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Um, I mean, it looks pretty good. Uh, I I want to say like for me, my my interpretation of like spring is like flourishing on like flowers and stuff like that. So you don't have much small foliage. But not air, like doesn't always have to be like a shit ton of foliage and all that stuff. Mm. Okay. I think my biggest critique is there's no rain. <laughs> my second biggest critique is it's not snowing as well. Mm. I fixed that. Oh, because of the We're silhouette. Insert what is all it? of the weather at once. Why is there a frog on the side of that rock? It's... You know, I didn't know he was there until just a second ago. There we go. So now it's snowing, it's raining, and it's a thunderstorm. Perfect. And add beach noises. Only beach noises? How well, little you know of me, Brandon. Uh, I gotta turn on the sound for you. Oh my god. <laughs> What about the music? The arrows, the this, the that. Every box. It's a spring. It's springtime after global warming. Makes sense. <laughs> it's the spring apocalypse. Yeah, I I don't know. Ours is pretty close to each other. Mm -hmm. I have no idea who will we on that. In the comment section below. <laughs> who won? Who's next? 
You decide. Beautiful springtime picture from Tyler with dragonflies and sunshine and the hypnotoad. <laughs> or whatever that thing Brandon submitted is. What? <laughs> whatever thing? I don't rely on just a hypnotoad to try to win. Well, then you're doing it wrong. No, we chose totally different weather patterns, so it feels like totally different. It has totally different atmospheres. But that was fun. We'll choose Tyler's. Gotta save that. Choose Tyler's. I have no total half spoken. <laughs> 